Hi loves! Welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, I'm Cara with Sale on a Budget, where we do beauty, fashion, and lifestyle. If that seems like something you're interested in, please hit that red subscribe button and join the Slay fam. Today, as always, I got a special treat for you loves, so you might as well stay tuned and keep on watching. So today we have actually another press on nail tutorial. So if you don't know, that's how the whole intro kind of started because I was talking about my nails. <laughs> and I just kind of kept it going because I like the way it is. So anywho, that's beside the point. So yeah, y'all already know what time it is. It's time for you to grab a drink grab a snack and let's chit chat okay love so today's video is not sponsored i do want to let you all know that before we get started so all the items that i'll be using i did purchase with my own money okay so you ain't gotta question it now if you know kids want to give me a sponsorship go ahead and send that my way but right now this is not a sponsored video also if you hear any background noise right now your girl did do good i do have my son sleep but if he happens to wake up and you hear any background noise just charge it to my head and i'm hard because just keep watching the video because he ain't gonna stop the show but let's go ahead and get into this tutorial Right up to the side of my mountain Until 
Okay, love, so I hope you guys enjoyed that my, my tutorial, okay? I'm trying to contain my excitement because y'all know how I feel about nails in general. I love nails. So I decided to bring you loves along. This is not my first nail tutorial that I have done, but I did it the way that I love to do. If you haven't watched my glue versus glue video, you can go see that and check out. That was my very first tutorial on two different methods and what I actually recommend. But today, um, I'm gonna just talk about the prep, how I applied it, and then like my final thoughts on this video. So first things first is like the prep. You should always know to prep your nails. Um, I prep my nails and what I, I gave y'all a little clip where I, kind of, I tried to narrate through it. Let me slow down because I'm super excited. <laughs> I got my dog sleep and I got the nails on. Okay, so anywho, yes, um, you should always prep your nails. If your nails are not lasting, you're just not doing the prep. You have to dehydrate your nails, so that means you have to get the oils out of them. It should definitely be no water on them um, to get your nails to get that longevity wear. Okay, so I always prep my nails. I always have alcohol, acetone. You know me. I'm gonna keep that acetone on dick. Ain't really no uh, alcohol, so I'm gonna have acetone. And majority of these products I got, I did get them from Dollar Tree. I always have a cuticle pusher, a cuticle cutter, and I generally use that one tool that was purple that had a two ends to it it's it's magnificent um i always use a fingernail file the diamond brand is what you can find in dollar tree i do have tons of them i love those fingernail files okay i wish they had something that actually curved but anywho that's beside the point so um i always do my little prep now you can do you a little mani so like soaking your nails I kind of try to do that a week prior to doing my nails. I give my nails always like a week off. So sometimes I don't wear nails to work, okay? Cause I need my nails to breathe. I need to be putting oils on them. Actually, I did that before I did this set. So I didn't film that for you guys because I had to actually do it. I didn't even do that for my toenails. I should have. I've already filmed a previous video on my nail care, but I didn't do what I did for my mani like I should have for my petty. Okay, so before I apply my nails, I have already taken like the gunk and stuff off my nails and then I like do a little mani, put oils on my nails and I wear my nails like that for a week and then I apply press on nails, okay? So that is how I pretty much prep my nails to get ready to have that longevity, a long lasting wear. Now how I apply my nails is pretty simple. I pretty much, as you seen, put them out in order, making sure that's what I'm actually feeling, like the style. I don't know if y'all seen in there. I was actually saying I wanted to do this LA color nail and I end up doing this, um, of course, bringing the salon home. <laughs> y'all know me, but I'm bringing it to my little filming room. So this is a Kiss Gel Fantasy Nail. I don't know why in my spirit, in my spirit, cause it was in my spirit, in my soul, to really do this nail. And I'm glad I did, I'm bringing it to you all. So this is Gel, gel Fantasy Nail. I just recently started writing the names on the bottom of this. I'm not sure the name of this nail, but this nail is in the extra long length. I did get this from my local Walmart. And I am so surprised by this nail, but we'll talk about that in my final thoughts. So applying these nails were pretty easy. Um, I've never worn an extra long tapered nail, so this is in the shape tapered. Um, and it's a matte color nail and it was giving, okay? So applying the nails was pretty easy after doing all the prep for the nails. And um, as normal, I always arrange them out to see which ones I want. Cause sometimes one nail bed can be bigger than the other. Take for instance, my pinky. This is generally an 11 and this is generally a 10. So my left hand is an 11 and my right hand is a 10. Sometimes nails can vary like that. So I like to lay my nails out to ensure I'm actually gonna use them and I know which one. The top is my left, the bottom is my right. It's always how it's gonna be. Because I am right-handed, so my left hand generally looks the best cause I'm not left hand dominant, okay? So that is easier um, when it comes to applying nails. Also a tip for a beginner. If you don't know how to do nails, you should save your thumb and your pointer to, for, la for last so you can have that applying pressure ability, okay? So I generally, I go from pinky to thumb. That's how I apply them. So pinky to pinky, um, ring finger to ring finger. So I try to do that when I'm actually doing the, the tutorial and I don't want it too sped up that you don't see it. So maybe I'll do one in a little bit of real time, but I did not do that today. 
for this particular video so yeah that is just a beginner tip y'all seen the glue that i use like i said if you don't know my favorite glue go watch my um glue versus glue and i link it down at the bottom i'll also link it down in this video as well but applying the nails were pretty easy i had no problem with these nails um whatsoever honestly and with the applying method because sometimes you can and you just it's gonna let you know how that longevity is going to be so hopefully that helps you guys with the tutorial if not please you know let me know down in that comment section because heck i need some help on how to film this because this i'm not gonna lie to you it's not the easiest thing to film but i'm doing it for you loves okay so my final thoughts with these nails you know they're getting a 10 out of 10 i would not be giving kids my money if they weren't giving me the quality now here's some things about these nails that I didn't really say with applying them and um, the prep care and everything. So these nails gave me a lot more than what I was expecting. I generally wear nails for 72 hours. So if you don't know what 72 hours is, that's three days. Three full days and like a half a day because I'm going to generally put them on the day prior. So that's what happened with these nails. Um, I'm going to be wearing these nails for the weekend. So Friday, Saturday and Sunday full days and I have applied them on Thursday. So I've been wearing my little clickety clacks, okay, uh, for three days. And I honestly love these nails. So y'all already know I love, and I do mean love, a tapered square nail. Now I've never wore an extra long one. I've only wore a long, and long is still giving me the, the grabbers, the attention. Okay, so um, I've never worn extra long. And this kind of almost scared me a little bit. I'm glad I got them in a matte length, uh, matte style, if that makes sense. Now what surprised me about these nails the durability i'm not gonna lie to you the longer the nail is sometimes you're not gonna get the best durability out of the nail these nails are a lot stronger like like they are they're strong i got like a little this is a disc for like a, a laptop i don't use it like that but y'all these nails are freaking strong now um generally kiss nails do round i can see that happening at the second week mark um, but I see that with a lot of nails. Okay. So I don't know if y'all see my nails up close and personal. I'll actually, you know what, insert a little clip right here so y'all can see them. But after the first day of me kind of getting the glue and stuff off, cause I didn't do that all in the video for you guys. They look rather nice and I honestly do love them. I love this extra length. Now, when, if y'all thinking that you can't like do household chores, I do household chores. I get Trey in and out the car seat. Um, I do have a little tool now, but I used to use my knuckle to kind of like unbuckle the buckle. But yeah, I do a lot of things. So that's washing dishes, that's doing clothes, that's vacuuming, that's mopping, that's everything because the nails can't stop the show when it comes to tray. So you can do household chores in this. Now, I'm not going to lie to you, probably as the weeks go on, they're going to get brittle because you have done everything with them. Open a can of Coke, all kinds of things. Put on the anklet because that'd be one of my things for me they may not last like that but if you're like me you're looking for a weak wear it depends these nails are weak wear my work nails sometimes i might want that two week to month wear these are going to get you there and that is surprising from this line the gel fantasy line don't be giving me like that all the time they don't give me that mm, like that all the time should i say now that lets me know that kiss is working on making their nails better i don't like when people try to diss kiss when you see like i make press on nails but this is not this if this is what you think that's not what we do they stuff is really good so i would not be telling you about these nails if they weren't good okay now i'm here for all the small business um ladies that's out here doing it girl do your thing do your thing do your thing but um <laughs> yeah these nails are still doing it so if you're looking for a really really affordable uh, look these nails were at my local walmart they were under eight dollars y'all know me eight dollars you're getting 28 nails in a pack it does come with the glue it does come with adhesive um a cuticle pusher and a mini foul and you can get you an at-home medicare for under 30 minutes honestly if you do all the extraness you're gonna be at 30 minutes if you're just applying the nails honestly honey this is gonna take you like 10 minutes okay um i generally sit down and watch um tv when i do this next little tip for you all apply these nails at night okay apply them at night do not get your hands wet so 
you need to be getting ready for bed when you're applying these. So I've already taken my bath. I've given Trey a little bath. I have washed my dishes. I've done everything I need to do when it comes to taking my makeup off, all that kind of stuff. And then I'm gonna sit down and apply these nails. They be doing wonders, okay? So when I get up in the morning, it kind of feels like, you know how a new set feels? It gives me that feeling. And I know the grabbers are ready to be doing the work at that point because I've uh, properly applied them. So I hope all my tips and tricks was able to help you ladies out and I will definitely give these nails a 10 out of 10. I will 110%, 120%, 130, 50, 40. Uh, what did I just go back? <laughs> <laughs> recommend these nails okay hands down they don't get my money they gonna get this coin okay this is why I'm working so I can I guess uh, put food on their table I don't know but uh, yeah so I would definitely recommend these nails. okay loves if you made it to this portion you have made it to the end of the video thank you for rocking with your girl and all her quirkiness and corniness okay it really <laughs> it really warms my heart when y'all really think I'm funny <laughs> But anywho, thank you for thank you for making it to this portion of the video. If you did make it to this portion, please leave me a little nail emoji down at the bottom. Okay, I've been doing this all video long, but the nails are nailing. Okay, the grabbers are grabbing. But anywho, um, y'all already know we are growing the slave fam. If you're here from TikTok. I'm giving a lots of, lots of deals on a lot of things. I'm going to tell you how to get it for the cheapest price for the low low. Where to get it at, okay? Um, so, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. I love conversating with you guys. I hope you guys like me in the chat as well. So, if you're part of the Premiere fam, thank you. Um, I really appreciate it. Also, if you would like to see more of me, do not forget to follow me over on my social medias. You can find me on IG, TikTok, and Twitter. And my name is at Stay on a Budget Zero on all three platforms so y'all already know with that loves <laughs> don't forget to stay on the budget don't forget that God loves you and so do I and until next time loves bye